so lookup method you can use this concept for interfaces abstract classes and for concrete classes also if you find any abstract method with a secondary type return value then compulsory you can provide implementation to that methods so lookup method build path add ioc jars along with this ioc jars you need to add one more jar file here to generate runtime proxies to generate runtime proxies we required cg lib squared cg lib libraries along with your ioc jars along with your ioc jars along with your four ioc jars you need to add cg lib jars this cg lib jars will help us to generate runtime proxies so for runtime proxies we need to add the cg libs yeah cg lib jars you have to add this cg lib library to generate proxies so add this cg lib also to your application yeah and create a bean write one interface write one abstract class and write one concrete class you can override i mean you can provide implementation to interface and you can override methods of abstract and you can override methods of concrete class also so just i'll write here i'll write three classes okay first one interface interface car this car interface expected implementation part is my engine public engine my car engine this is my required implementation method generate engine class okay so car is a interface this interface it have one abstract method my car engine and write one more class abstract class write a class bus make this class as a abstract and write one abstract method here write a abstract method abstract public engine my bus engine so abstract class along with this abstract method it can have concrete methods also right so here we can have along with this abstract method concrete methods also in this bus class and write one concrete class write a concrete class truck here provide one concrete method implementation public engine my truck engine provide implementation here in that implementation create your required engine object here private string engine name set name get name and here e dot set engine name truck engine finally return that same engine but if you don't want this implementation if you don't want this implementation you can override by using lookup method okay we have implementation here but if you don't have if you don't want this implementation part you can override it by using lookup method okay i'll show you with car interface bus abstract class truck concrete class so for this three classes if you want to provide implementations by using lookup method create xml resource here first just start from car for car i want to provide implementation for car interface for car interface provide lookup method dependency injection provide lookup method bean id car class class name beans dot car in this car class we have one look, lookup method car actually it is not a class it's a interface in this interface we have an abstract method the method name is 
द मेथड नेम इज माइ कार इंजन सो फॉर दिस इंजन यू नीड टू प्रोवाइड इंप्लीमेंटेशन हाउ यू कैन जस्ट बाइजिंग बी इन रेफरेंस यू कैन पास ए बी इन ऑब्जेक्ट रेफरेंस केयर विच बी इन ऑब्जेक्ट दिस मेथड एक्सपेक्टिंग ए इंजन बी इन ऑब्जेक्ट प्रिपेयर ए बस अ कार इंजन हियर बीन आई डी ई क्लास नेम बीन्स डॉट इंजन एंड वी हैव वन सेटर मेथड स्वेट नेम वी कैन पास कार इंजन हियर शिफ्ट इंजन शिफ्ट कार इंजन नाउ पास दट इंजन रेफरेंस केयर नाउ इट इज ए इंटरफेस राइट बट फॉर दिस फॉर दिस इंटरफेस स्प्रिंग विल प्रोवाइड इंप्लीमेंटेशन बाय रीडिंग दिस टैक्स इट विल अंडरस्टैंड ओके दिस कार क्लास इंजन मेथड रिक्वायर्ड से इंजन रेफरेंस सो स्प्रिंग विल ट्राई टू इंप्लीमेंट यूर कार क्लास बाई इंप्लीमेंटिंग यूर कार क्लास फ्रॉम दट कार क्लास माई कार इंजन मेथड इट विल रिटर्न दिस सेम इंजन रेफरेंस and you just try to load it into ioc and check it whether it is creating object or not you can find actually for interfaces it is not possible to create object but spring will do this try to load it into container application context new class path xml application context load that resource reference here resources slash spring dot xml yeah try to get car object we are trying to calling we are trying to getting car bean actually car is interface but will it return interface object is it having capability to create objects for interfaces no it will provide one implementation that implementation object it will return to us in the form of car interface system dot out dot printl and call c dot my car engine and it will return a engine object from that engine object you can get car name and you can run this under right it is providing a implementation without implementation it is not possible to return interface object can we thought interfaces for interfaces objects creating objects are possible not possible right so internally what it is doing it is providing implementation that implementation class object it is returning you can print that class name by using the c reference the class name is what so this class generating but can you find that class in your beans folder refresh is there any class dot class file go to build location and there try to see it is showing one class in our beans package but we don't have any class here right okay from build path is there any class we don't have any class here but it is showing one class here the class name is beans dot car dollar enhancer by cglib some hash code printing here so this class generated at runtime actually and this class is child class for your car interface for your car interface it is providing one implementation this is what actually implementation class name by using runtime byte code it will generate proxy classes by using runtime byte code it will generate proxy classes so it i mean you no need to have dot class file here at runtime it will generate code directly that code it will load into your jvm no need to have dot class files so in your application if you have interfaces 10 interfaces and if you do lookup method implementations totally in your jvm it will try to load 20 classes but you will find only 10 interfaces okay so application can have more than five i mean application can have classes more than dot class files 
your application let's say in your application if you have 10 dot class files jvm may load more than 10 dot class files some classes may be proxy classes okay here it is generating a proxy class that proxy class object here it is returning okay the same type of implementation you can provide to this bus also in bus we have one abstract method for this abstract method also you can provide implementation here so for bus for bus abstract class provide this lookup method dependency injection for bus abstract class it is a abstract class for this abstract class do lookup method dependency injection create a bus object in bus class we have one method my bus engine it is abstract method so you can use this method as a lookup method and it required a engine object create a engine bus engine like some Tata engine pass e1 reference here then you can expect bus object also from your client class you can expect bus class object also here you can get you just get bus object bus reference b finally you can expect a bus object but it is it is not actually bus it will return bus proxy object b dot get my bus engine dot get name here it is car code and here it is for bus and run this shift engine it belongs to this class and here Tata engine and the class is bus proxy class and if you have concrete implementation in that concrete implementation if you don't want existing implementation here we have one truck in this truck we have some IHR truck this implementation if you don't want if you want to override it you can override this implementation like for this abstract class how we are doing for abstract class in the same way for truck concrete class for truck concrete class <coughs> do the lookup method dependency injection truck class in this truck class I don't want this existing truck implementation and truck types what we have some bench truck so now actual truck implementation object is each truck object we are injecting but by using what we are overriding by using this bench truck we are trying to overriding existing implementation okay try to get this truck object here get truck object truck t dot get class name and t dot get my truck object then run this you can see overriding by using other engine object means already existing implementations here it is overriding so finally what we are doing by using this lookup method we are doing overriding so for implementing interface we have to override for implementing abstract class we have to override for implement i mean to override a existing concrete method we have to override so finally by using lookup method what we are doing we are doing overridings you can do overridings you can do override into interface you can do override into abstract you can do overridings into concrete classes also Okay? Yep.